What's up, Parkins humans? Buta here. So, guys, if you're wondering why I am here in Black Rock Deeps with these Dark Iron Doors, well, guys, we now know how the scenario to acquire this Ald Race will play. So, in order to play the scenario and a lot of this race, we will need to reach Exalted Reputation with the 7, seven Legion, which is the PvP faction for BFA and also you need to have completed the, the, the war campaign in Battle for Azeroth. As we met these two requirements, you will be able to unlock and play the scenario in the storm with the Embassy. So the story is quite messy because the other Chirons are not having a good time. In fact, the Venture Company have managed to steal Iron Core. The one of the most sacred treasures of the Dark Iron and the weapons of the past Emperor Dragon Terrestrial. And this is also a cool vanilla reference because this hammer was really hunted by players back in vanilla because it was one of the best weapons in the game, even, co even good as Ankirash weapons. And the fact that it came from a normal dungeon makes it really hunted by fury warriors and rogues. But also what the Vector Cop has done is even much terrible because they managed to damage the Black Anvil. This is another cool vanilla reference because the Black Anvil was very crucial for Blacksmith because not only it was used to craft fire resistance gear using the Dark Iron uh, Dark Iron Orb, but also it was the only place in the game where you could craft the Sulfuron Hammer. When it combined with the Iron of Sulfurus, it allowed you to create the first legendary items in the game, Sulfurus the End of Ragnaros. So we don't know how we will recover the Iron Pot, or we will travel back to Kazan and kick some Goblin Asses, but we do know that for fix the Black Anvil, we will need to travel to Molten Core and acquire a piece of Ragnaros or the base because this is the only item strong enough to fix this, this relic. So we ask the permission to travel there, but when we take this fragment, we discover that it is not powerful enough. We need to empower it. And the only place where we could do that is no other than the Firelands. So we ask again permission to Lord Svaldron, the current leader of the Firelands. But something fishy is going on there. In fact, a cult of Dark Irons that do not accept Moira because she's a bronze beard as their current queen. And they want to overthrow Lord Smoldron and put back Ragnaros in place in order to have the old leader again. Because, guys, yes, Dagger Taurosian was the emperor of the Dark Iron, but the, all of them were pretty much servants or slaves, if you want to say better, of Ragnaros. So, we will deal up with these cults of Dark Iron, we will power up back our molten core fragments we will fix the black anvil and after doing so you have now managed to unite all this fact all this small faction of the Kairos into one and now they are ready to fight for the alliance in the further conflicts in the land of Kultiras and Zandalar. A really cool story a bit less Empathic, little less extraordinary than the Bagar ones, but they have to say it was really cool and with a lot of nice reference to Vanilla, which was I was hoping because these their cattle were pretty much a focused race back in that times. So, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you soon in the next video. See ya!